Welcome back to some PvP or Skyblock. It actually hasn't been that long since the last recording, at least for me personally. It was like, uh, I don't know, a few days. I did make some changes to this since the last time, though. This is the final, final product uh, that actually allows me to get experience. All I do is basically just go down in here and I just sit here. I sit at the edge and the experience will just kind of drop on the floor and flow towards me. And then over here, I've got blazes in case I want to turn around and kill them to get some blaze rods. It'll also give me experience and I can also just sell it for a little bit of extra money. What is... Hello? I didn't tell you, so here is last uh, month's media kit. Yeah, that actually, yeah, that did remind me. I don't think I even mentioned that because there was this broken stuff and I never contacted staff about it. Oh, okay. Should we get whatever that is? I'll have to see in a bit. I can't, I think, I, I'm assuming it's some kind of important, it's a summer crate. I can see it at the bottom, never mind. An admin skull, okay, and a small gubit pouch. So, fun fact, um, I did know about the media kit. Yeah, I, I don't know what I did with the other item. I was like, oh, I got, like, an item that was like, oh, you can't use this, blah, blah, blah. I was like, okay, so I get rid of this. And then I got this, which is also disabled, contact staff. Um, I'm just gonna trash it. Ooh, 2,100 gubits. What can I get with that? Monthly crate bundle, three times monthly crates. Oh, man. You know how tempting that is? But then, on the other hand... I could also get a permanent G kit. Mainly, I'm interested in the super spawner pouch. I think I'm gonna do it just for that fact alone. Because that's something that helps me throughout every season, not just once. I think it's the best purchase I can get. Give me that. Yes! This armor is Unbreaking 6 Protection 6. That's technically better than my other armor, except it has no enchants. That's still very sick. I am Tycho now, guys. Nah, sorry. I gotta, I, I gotta have my speed, though. I don't even know what a cannon is. I had a plan for this, and now I'm starting to think it might have to involve a cannon instead. Mystery seed pouch, grill plant, incubator, jellyfish incubator. Let's see what I get from these super spawner pouches. What? Wait, what are these actually? Okay, so each of these are rarities. So we got basic, exotic, legendary, and epic. So I'm assuming basic is the, re the, the lowest of the low. Um, creeper, cow, goat, and pig. Not too bad. I think epic would be next. More creepers. Let's do legendary. That gave us a... No way legendary gives us, gives us a goat. And for our exotic super spawner, here we go. Bam. We got... No way. Just creepers? Just creepers, huh? That is so messed up. All right. What do we get? We got a farm cannon. Oh, it has usage. Ah. So 18 uses. Crop multipliers 5. Range of 5. Right click on farm of crops to harvest uh, multiply the drops. Can I use this in the slash zone. We're gonna warp to the crates. We're gonna open up this beautiful summer crate and see what it gives us. Please give me something good. That would be this one here. Bam. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and open up all nine rewards and see what we get. 3,000 you sell one. Still not sure if these work on the uh, whatever the auto collector is. Mob coin generator. Mob cannon. Oh, that's awesome. 75 use, mall multiplier of 10, range of 5. I definitely have to try that out. Ashura G kit pouch, which I have the kit unlocked, so that's not that useful. A strength 2 pet, medium summer pouch, which can give us anywhere from 10,000 to 15,000 mob coins, 150 million to 250 million cash, 5 million to 10 million XP. And our final reward, what is it going to be? Please be something good and not something sad. I'll take a glitch rank, that'd be pretty sick. Oh, or a puff rank, I guess. Eventually, I'll organize these and make them better, but for now, this will work. Do you need water? You do need water. There. A very simple mob coin farm. And then all I have to do is put the water down, it'll go across, all the mob coins get carried into this, and then all I have to do is put down my chest. Okay, so we got 48 blazes, we got 10 witches. How does this work? It's a multiplier of 4 and range of 5. <laughs> that thing just obliterated them. That is, okay, that is awesome. I have a billion dollars? I have a billion dollars, guys. I have a billion. Um, ooh, you know what? I want to actually upgrade the slots to four. Now, with that extra slot, I can have the witches actually in here with the other guys. And they can all die, and I'll get all the money. It'll be great. And then I can just kill these guys. I gave you a billion, by the way. Oh, that's why I got a billion, guys. I was given a billion. Well, there's only one thing to do. 1.35 and i'm gonna bet 10 million it's gonna win ready never mind apparently i'm not gonna gamble because it won't let me so instead ooh, wait a minute i'm gonna hold my money i'm gonna hold my money i'll do that for a future video oh they finally fixed it it doesn't it's actually going down are you giving me 
Guys, I'm getting... Guys, I'm getting absolutely super boosted today. I swear these are much bigger. Because I used to be able to fit so many of these here. I th oh, no. It's not bigger. I think the way they work is different. You used to be able to, like, put them right next to each other. And now, you can't. They're more solid. That's okay. Well, I finally want to go test this zone thing with these cannons. Because I don't know if it works the way that I think it's going to work. Like, can I blast this? Or do I have to do it on my island? Let's find out. Oh. Oh, guys, it works in this world. <laughs> Wait. <gasps> this thing is awesome! Wait a minute. Now, my question is, what happens if I try and shoot it into carrots? I mean, surely it'll be like, no, you can't do that, right? Yeah, I figured. Oh, God. I didn't even think about this. All of my wheat's going into slash clam. Oh, no. Okay, I need to be more careful when I do this. I don't want my claim to fill up again, because my god. Well, currently I have a 5 times. I was just given a 10 times cannon. Well, that's just going to be insane. I think I... S oh, I have to sell after every cannon now. That is actually insane. Every time I fire this thing, I'm making uh, 7 million plus, I mean, 14 million, uh, about somewhere around 7 million from that. So, like, I mean, that is insane, dude. Can I kill these guys with a mob cannon? I kind of want to test it, but I feel like it's a waste. God, I'm up to two billion now. I've made a billion dollars, guys. This is freaking insane. And, by the way, in case you missed it, if people are going to be like, Well, you took handouts. No, I made a fair exchange. A bunch of free shit for one of the skin packs I had that I didn't want. That's the end of our cannon, unfortunately. Um, but I do have two more mob cannons I can use down the line, which is kind of nice. Um, I guess now, I just chop? If I had a harvester hoe, I would absolutely build that thing up. Actually, like, is there any enchants I can use on a hoe that'll basically do that effect? Telekinesis. I sure can. In that case, let me see. I think Smash is my best kit. Oh, it doesn't give a hoe at all, does it? Oh, I saw Telekinesis 1. I think that's all I need as long as it succeeds. It, it, that is 50% chance. I think I wing it. Okay, so I got some enchants I want to try. Inquisitive 5 is... That would be insane. I'm gonna try it on my sword. Please work. Yes, okay. Telekinesis 1. Nailed it. Uh, well, I don't really need that. Bomber 3. The question is, do I want to do... Do I want to do Bomber 3 or do I want to hold off? First off, I gotta do the, the lowest one, which is Bulk 4. Which succeeded, and then Double Dip, which did succeed as well. Um, I've got... Oh, I already have Airstrike. Do I yellow it? Yes! Airstrike 1. Okay, and then I've got Sprinkler 1. Oh, please tell me that's not... I'm still gonna try and mine out. Oh, sorry. Telekinesis doesn't work on this. So that was all pointless. Uh, oh well. Hey, I appreciate you giving me this then, because apparently all of that didn't matter. Is there a way to disenchant? Eventually, I want to get to level 5. That's definitely one of my goals. Hey, look at that. Speaking of levels, level 4. I need 512,000 experience before I can reach level 5. I mean, in total, not... 512 more and it, you know that that would just be insane this was a lot of fun we did some enchanting we got some handouts we farmed a little bit we made a lot of money and honestly i think i've decided i'm definitely going to spend my money on some better uh some better spawners down the line but that's for the future i want to reorganize these but i gotta let them do their thing first so i'm going to slowly do that over the week. By the time you see the next one, I should have this all organized. My island's gonna look nice. I'm gonna make some changes, maybe even build a bigger farm. I'm not really sure. But that is it for this one. I hope you guys did enjoy. Join the PvP War server. All the information is down in the description, and I will see you guys in the next one.